Hey guys, welcome back to Pinching Pennies with Priscilla and this is going to be my Rite Aid haul for today, July 22nd. I did three separate transactions. The first one is here, this is the second one, and this one is the third one. Now I did not do a lot of stay free purchases today because I'm waiting for coupons to come in the mail. I only purchased two papers today and that was to use the coupons right here. And then I had the one coupon that came in my local, my um, subscription paper, and I used that one coupon at CVS. So no more stay free other than the three that you're going to see. I'm waiting on the, my coupons to come in the mail, and then I'll do my transactions with the stay free and the Revlon at CVS uh, later this week. So let's get to this Rite Aid haul here. My first transaction I did the gain. I did... Uh, eight of the bare lodos aspirin okay let me start over the gain was 4.98 i had a one dollar off coupon you guys know where the coupons come from and all that so that was 3.98 the bare aspirin um you had to buy twenty dollars worth to get the six dollar plus up i bought eight of those at uh, regular price 3.29 gold price is 2.63 and I used eight of the three dollar off manufactured coupons. I paid zero out of pocket and I got a six dollar plus up plus two dollars and ninety six cents in overage went towards other items. The St. Joseph's that is on sale and I had a typo in my transactions. It should have been a 200 count right there and that is regular price $9.99 and thanks to I think it was Nappy Girl San Diego who left a comment letting me know that since these were regular price $9.99, I was able to use that $3 off um, $9.99 coupon. Even though they're on sale today, the regular price was $9.99, so I was able to use that $3 coupon. And so these were on sale for $5.99, and you got back the $5 plus up. The Revlon nail polish here. These are buy one get one 50% off. There's a limit of two per card on the promotion. And the regular price was they were on sale for $4.99. I think the regular price is $4.99. Two of these would total $7.48. I used two of the $1 manufacturer coupons. I did not have those $2 coupons that everybody had from CVS. So I used the $1 coupons. I used two of the $2 video value um, coupons as well. So for these two, I paid $1.48 and got back a $4 plus up. The Belvita, these were $3 each. I got two of those. I used two of the $1 manufactured coupons, not manufactured, two of the $1 Rite Aid coupons from Facebook. And I used two of the $0.75 cents off manufactured coupons. And then I got two of the Stay Free. Those are $3 each at Rite Aid. And I used two of the $2 manufactured coupons. So you pay $2 for two and you get back two $1 plus ups, which means you're paying zero for those after your plus ups. So here's my receipt for my first transaction. As you can see, everything is here. all of my coupons and let's see if I used any plus ups yeah I, need, I used a ten dollar and a four dollar plus up on this transaction so after that my subtotal was 49 cents and after taxes I paid 151 and I did remember to put that on my uh, Visa card from Verizon. So I paid zero out of pocket, you guys, and I got back six dollars, seven dollars, eight dollars, five dollars. So I got back and I used one. I use, I think I used a um I think I used a two dollar one off of here. So I got back a total of six, seven. 8, 13, plus 4, I believe. So 17. I believe I got $17 back on that transaction after paying zero money out of pocket. Okay? 
So my second transaction. No, on the first transaction, I think I got fifteen dollars back. Sorry about that, because I used one two dollars on this transaction right here. Okay, so this one same thing. I got eight of the bear, one of the Saint Josephs, two of the Revlon, and I got four of the Belvitas on here. And here is my receipt for that. Do you want cereal, Aaron? Stop acting crazy. She don't normally eat the cereal, Keita. Is any sausage in there? So I used a $10 plus up here and a $2 plus up from my first transaction. And I had a subtotal of $0.01. Cents. After taxes, I paid $0.73. Cents. I put that on my Visa gift card. So I paid zero money for this transaction. And I got back two eight ten um fifteen nineteen so i got back nineteen dollars for paying zero money for this transaction here all right so my last transaction right here i got two of the kellogg cereal i got one frosted flake and one apple jacks those are 188 each i had a dollar off a two coupon for those i did the um, what did I do here? Get on the Nabisco. Yeah. I did a Nabisco deal so that I can get the single check rebate. So you had to spend four dollars. I mean, twelve dollars in Nabisco Oreos, and you'll get back a five dollars single check rebate. Plus, for this week's transactions, you'll get back two two dollar plus ups for four of them. Basically, for every two, you get two dollars. So I bought two of the Oreo. Cakesters, and these are three dollars a piece this week. And I got two Oreos one the golden, one the regular, three dollars a piece as well. So that's twelve dollars. And I used two of the one dollar off of two video value coupons. I did not have the printable coupons for the manufacturer coupons, there are uh, one dollar off two manufacturer coupons, but I didn't have those. So for these, I paid ten dollars. For these four Nabisco products, I got back two two dollar plus ups. Plus, I'll submit for the five dollar single check rebate. So, really, after the plus ups and the rebate, I'm only paying a dollar for all four of those. Okay, so here's my receipt for that, and you'll see everything here. I used a four dollar plus up on this transaction. And two, three dollars. I use a four dollar plus up and two three dollar plus ups on this transaction. And my subtotal was one seventy six. I put that on my Visa gift card, so I paid no cash out of pocket, and I got back two two dollar plus ups for the Nabisco, and I would get back an additional five dollar single check rebate. So I'm getting back a total of nine dollars for spending no money out of pocket. So those are my three transactions that I did today at Rite Aid. So stay tuned for my transactions for CVS. See you guys in the next video. Happy shopping, happy savings. Bye.